And uh, it's honestly, I could just play this game forever. I was on land and never get bored of it. But I don't want to go through the same thing with my other PS4, to be honest. I've got the, um, um, got wrestling training tonight. So I'm going to do as many videos as I can to, to literally entertain you guys. This is, this is mainly the reason why I don't started YouTube, because I wanted to entertain as many people as I can. I've got about 400 and... 97 subs at the moment. I appreciate that you guys are the best. And, um, and when you go to buy this game, it is worth it. You can go to any part of the ship. It does not take go to this area, go to this area. It just lets you go wherever you want. Oh man, wow, look at that. See if I can go into that room ahead. This room in it just. Right room in the other end. I'll see if I can go into that room. Um, that would have that cup on the floor. That would have been used for someone to drink in. And I'll, I'll there's a dresser in there. I'll tell you what that would have been used. What that would have been used for. I'm just going a little coat or jacket. That would have been from a crew officer or a passenger. Remember the crew, you get the idea. The clo clothes back then were really different. How they dressed were different. The clothes, you get the idea. Um, that, is a, that wardrobe you saw in pieces in that one room. This, if your hair didn't look right and you wanted to brush your hair, that's the sort of thing you would do. Literally, you get the idea. You get the idea of where I'm coming from. And these drawers here, if you had any, if like the girls, the, little, the um, women had any jewellery with them, and they want them kept safe, they would put them in these little drawers here. It, depending on what it is, really. Uh, here we go. And um, the same thing for this mirror. Uh, if you wanted to wash your hands... Um, and your face, this is what you would where you would come to do exactly that. If you just wanted to have a rest and have a good night, sleep, you could lie on the sofa if you had, or you could, if you wanted to read a book, you could just sit and read your favourite book. And um, to sleep, you're sleeping, you'd be in this position, but the bed wouldn't be in this like, exact angle. Well, you guys know know what I mean. Hopefully. Um, so this is the room you're coming. Bit well, you would you would get um, if you booked a room, and you were travelling on your own. This is the sort of room you would you would literally come and you come in. This is the sort of room you would use. And that wardrobe, that in the wardrobe there would have been white starline coat hangers hanging up. You could put your clo hang your clothes in, and the drawers. Was, for the drawers, you would have. Uh, here we go. Hang on. You would have had underwear, socks, shorts, trousers. You get the idea. Depending on if you've got a suitcase with you, you get the idea of what I mean. Uh, let's see if I can go in this room. Oh, but let me know. I managed to get in this room. That room had. That's the the um, dresser I was on about. That mainly broke apart from basically when it's it hits something it probably broke up from that. I'm not sure. If you watch James Cameron's Titan, when it's your inside of the ship and that when the dresser moving it smacks or something breaks, you'll see what I mean from that if you get what I mean. It's because of me autism I find it hard to explain things in a certain way. I tend to explain things differently to other people. Um, you get the idea of what I mean. I hope you guys understand. When you come to watch my videos, I will let you know. I t tend to go off subject and... Well, you get the idea. Here we go. Um, the wardrobe's not in the best condition, as you guys can see. And the same thing for the dresser. Um, that bad, If that bed wasn't there... That bit of that um bit what the mirror's attached to 
Well, the this bit here, the, the other half of the dresser, would have been where the the bed is laid on on the floor. And let uh, me go back out of the room, if I can manage. And um, I will let I will like um, if you learn from these videos of my, mine about Titanic, I will try to talk about Titanic as best as I can. These walls would have been like painted white. If you watch Titanic on Glories, like um. Watch Titanic on Glory's demo, or if you want to play the demo, I do recommend it. If you look, look at the walls when you come down this corridor, like one of these corridors, this corridor on um, demo for a while, you can get what I'm, you can get what I mean, where I'm coming from. Um, I will go into those rooms that, but that way, those three. I'm just gonna go down into this room here. Uh, this is a nice area. Um, so. The wardrobe is again, and again, the wardrobe's not in the best condition. Um, the dresser is, it's just fallen over from the, probably from the impact on the ocean floor, or when the ship stopped, the front bow section of the Titan at the front bit, the, for, what, the forecastle bit, when that started dipping into the water, that dresser just would have collapsed flat on the floor in that position. You get where I'm coming from. And the framework of the bed, the sofa is not in the best condition, as you can see what I mean. This part of the sofa has snapped. I don't know why or how. Um, I'll have to. Main. Um, so many cups and plates and saucers would have smashed from the. Um, when the front part of the ship started to go down into the water, the forecastle bit that is, and the cups and saucers and plates would have come flying off the shells, smashed on the floor. And this is a good game, I do recommend it, there's debris in that room, see if I can... Um, and also, um, this... And this is a really good, good room. Um, this is a really good room. If, if you was on Titanic, um, if you was a passenger or a crew member on Titanic during the disaster, what would you do? Help save many people, as women and children as possible, or save yourself? I'll go down as a hero. Comment down below. I oh, really would love to hear your guys' thoughts. Oh, now that would have been a plug socket sort of charging cable sort of thing. You get what I mean, where I'm coming from. And these lights as well, they would have been used to turn on lights, dim lights, you get the idea. Same thing, this light would have been... This is the on and off switch. If you were going out the room and you didn't need a light on to save electric, you would turn it off, go wherever you wanted, grant the um, grand staircase, the gymnasium, and you get the idea. And Titanic and Glory have literally recreated the in entire gymnasium. They've done a fantastic job of it. You can actually go in it on demo for a one, so if you want to try try the demo, I do recommend it. There we go. And, um,. Hang on a moment, boo for guys in a minute. This is Sentinels. This is a good game. This is a good game as well. I recommend it to you guys. It's available on Steam as well. If you want to play this game in VR, it's a whole new experience if you play it in VR. If you feel like you're actually at a wreck, put it that way. Wow.
You are laying my sister a bit. She's more than likely talking to the cat or you get the idea of what I mean. Um, she's only just a second got up. Bless her. Um, I just mainly when I'm playing this before doing the missions, I want to have a good look at the in entire inside of a ship where I tend to roam mm. quite a bit. So, <laughs> so I just yawned. So I just yawned for a minute. Um, the plates and the uh, sauces and bowls bowls would have been put in here to keep them um, warm. They've got these one sort of things in the yacht club that mine had. Um, in the yacht club at Butler's, where you would have like have your breakfast, tea, you get the idea. This is what they have one of these at um up there when you get to choose where other side of the buffet sort of thing when you're choosing your plates the sort of thing they had there as well um here we go go back out of this room bit in no oh, this room here is quite quite um oh nothing in the corner that wardrobe that's laid on the floor. What is stood right in the very corner where I'm looking? More than likely, more than anything. You can see from the bed, it uh, the bits of planks of wood in the, in the middle of the bed is starting to dissolve. Um, wood tends to dissolve rapidly, if you get the idea of where I'm coming from. And the the um sink is in great con well I was gonna say great well it's in the best condition but it's having it's got mold growing all over it same same thing for the mirror as you guys can see what I mean uh, there we go just gonna go look in this that that single bed is just split in half. It could be from a collision on the ocean floor or something like that. We, I'm not really sure. I'll have to look into that. I'll have to look into that. The wardrobe in the very, very corner uh, has been completely destroyed, as you can s just about tell. See if I can get you a better look. There you go. I'll go in this room now you mention it, so I can see you can see a better look of the room. Um. You would have more than likely, depending on who was staying in this room, you would have been sharing a room, uh, shared a room with she, they, or he. I don't know if you guys get it from that, but you would have been sharing a room with, depending on who you're travelling with, really. Uh, the the ward. This is the remains of the wardrobe, plus the furniture. Oh, the ceiling's not in the brilliant condition but on the Titanic on and Glory game you'll see what this room would look like oh, they are doing an update to it to um, demo 401 um, uh, they will do an update to it We'd, I'm not so sure how long it will take but just to let you know this is this room it, that room I'm looking in I don't I'm pretty sure it's. Hang on, what part of the ship are we at? Hang on a moment. Oh, we're at the front bit. So I'm pretty. If, uh, if we're down the corridor, I'm thinking about, which is in the. Down the Titanic on and Glory demo for a while. Correct me if I'm wrong. They haven't really put any. F if this is that room, they haven't, I don't think they put any room furniture in the room yet, but they said in the update. That didn't quite frequently mention the update. If you want to know what the update is, I'm pretty sure if you go on Google and put Titanic on Glory Alpha and you. Sh How did I find it? Hang on a moment. Where's my phone? Where's my phone? 
I'll show you guys how to get to the update, tell you about the alpha, hang on a moment. So you know what what page to look what to look for. Hang on a moment. <laughs> so it's that TikTok you did da 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 Freaking laughing at it. Basically, if you put um, Titanic on and Glory Alpha, what you need to look for it is Alpha announcement, Titanic on and Glory. You yeah, click on that and read the entire thing. I have, so I'm not going to go fully in depth into it, but they do. They said at one point. Well, just I'll let you guys look out for yourself. Um, if you want to know how, when the alpha is going to be released, when it's going to be finished, it's done. Yeah, if you read that, you'll get a, like. I hope you guys understand from that. Uh, it's going to be something. Now I'm gonna. I'm gonna go down this way now. Oh, what a nice room. Put this one on. Oh, bugger. It's alright, advert. You'll get used to it. Oh, another toilet. More toilets. Because where you come, you really need a toilet. Some had their own bathrooms. Hey, Papa. This is something. This is a good game. I do recommend it. I treat it more of an experience, more than anything. Well, you can bug off. Well, I'm saying no. It's not you lot, my sister keeps saying be doggy, and I'm not really up for it. You'll get used to it. You get used to it, you guys. What's the matter? Um. Yeah. Your attention. There we go. Easy, don't give it your belly, you What? Yes, help. Help, she me. thinks you're playing. She's a little tinker. She had me. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, my little mist. So, you lot, cats go to get so. Meaning, in other words, playing. <laughs> uh. 
Uh, oh, that's something. Going to those two rooms in a minute. Pardon me. Room now. But part of the wall is just completely disintegrated nearly. I'm looking at. I want to say there's an odd few bits of wall left, but I don't know if that's the right word. You can see what remains of that this part of the wall, as you guys can see what I'm trying trying to explain. Yay, I mean, oh. No, no, you just got, oh, poor Kate. It's alright, I'm just mucking about with my sister. You'll get used to it. So I'm right, just mucking about the cat. Well, go in this room quickly. Oh, I love this music. The, the one I'm listening to is Finding Pandora.
just as the ringleader. <laughs> what he wants to be. Of course, the little terror. A little terror. Hang on. We're on B deck as well now, if you guys are wondering. This is the elevators. If you wanted to go to D deck, these elevators would take you to that deck. If you just wanted to sit by and watch passengers walk by, that sofa's there for that reason.
Hello everyone. Hope you guys are doing well. Look at the wall textures. Cool, huh? Purser's office. Here's the dry nighter room, it's just down that way.
Right, I'm at D-Deck. Great. The area in front of you is the reception area. Head forward and you'll find a grand piano on the port side. Is that what I'm photographing? Yeah. An American historian is writing about the Titanic's musicians and wants a clear photograph of the piano. I can't believe this survived. It's beautiful, isn't it? Like something out of a film. I think this is the first room Henderson would have seen when he boarded. Did you want to take a minute to look around? Yeah, can I? Of course. The next task is the recovery in the Turkish baths. So head down the grand staircase when you're finished here. If you guys haven't already, subscribe as well. Down the back. Off switch well the light they would control the lights as well that's the on and off switch and probably the bottom one to turn the that on one of the both
Thank you.
Wow. And also, this is one of the other rooms on D deck. Just going to go back to the mission. Alright, I'm ready. Uh, Turkish baths are at the bottom of the staircase, right? Yep, straight down and off to starboard. I'm in the baths now. I can see the oral V here pinned under a pipe. Great. You'll need to get into position and attach the Done. flotation bag. Okay. Hey, it's working. Last the pipe step is lifting. Is to Great. When the pipe's completely lifted, you can attach your hook and drag the ROV out of here. Right. Ah, I think the motor failed. My arm's not responding. Is everything else okay? Is the line attached? Yeah, everything else is operational, and the line's still connected. Okay, we'll fix the arm when you're back on the surface, but for now, you'll have to be extra cautious. You need to drag the ROV back out to the ground staircase. The extra weight is going to make your controls Am I towing this thing all the way back to the sub? No, uh, you're not wrong no, there. Predator's really struggling. I'll need to Let move my other arm until we get this damaged one replaced. This is going to be difficult. Just take it nice and slow. I'm at the staircase again. The next step is to attach a tracker to the ROV. There is one in your compartment. Okay. Well, there she goes. Should I now follow up? The hook. No, we aren't finished down here yet. What's left to do? We need to collect the gear we left in the Turkish baths. The flotation gear? Yeah. It's too expensive to leave down here. You need to deflate the balloon and remove it from the pipe. All done. I'm heading back up. Great. See you soon. I'll get the lab ready to repair Predator.